sing? One of the characters I just love is Ash. She's the super cool and sassy rock star, and she's a porcupine. So for today, Jungle Bike Animal is a porcupine. So what are we waiting for? Let's go on the jungle safari. Vroom, vroom, beep, beep. Let's learn about porcupines. Porcupines are mammals, and they come from the animal order called Rodentia. Rodents are known for their incisor teeth that keeps growing, like the mouse, hamster, and beavers. They are all rodents. The word porcupine comes from the word dorm pig. Why do you think they have this name? Well, it got a little piggy nose, and porcupines are covered with more than thirty thousand sharp quills. Porcupines cannot shoot their quills, so don't be afraid if you see them. But the porcupines' quills easily come off, so don't try to touch them. Otherwise, this could happen. Ouch! The quills have scales and barbs, so once it gets stuck, it's hard to take it out. How are porcupines different from hedgehogs? Porcupines are bigger and have way more quills. Hedgehogs have around 5,000 quills. Their quills are not barb-like and don't come off easily, so it's not as dangerous. So some people have hedgehogs as pets. Where do porcupines live? There are around 30 species of porcupine living all over the world. In North and South America, Asia, Africa, and even in small parts of Europe. They live in the deserts, grasslands, and forests. They are everywhere! Quick trivia. Which porcupine species would Ash be? She's a crested porcupine. Yay! Porcupines are herbivores. They love to eat fruits, leaves, and roots. Can they climb trees? Yes, porcupines are great tree climbers. Can they swim? Not all species can, but some are good swimmers like this North American porcupine. Its quills are hollow and helps the porcupine float easily. Are porcupines nocturnal? Yes, they are more active during the night. During the day, they like to rest in their den in hollow trees or rocky areas. Porcupines may not have good eyesight. But they have excellent sense of hearing and smell. Porcupines have many predators, like the wolf, cougar, fisher, and the great horned owl. But how do predators hunt porcupines? They attack the parts of the porcupine where it doesn't have any quills. It's all over their body except for their belly, face, and feet. But not all hunt and well. The porcupines will fight back. Check out this bear. Do you see it has porcupine quills on its face? Ouch! Baby porcupines are called porcupets. What a pretty name. Porcupets are born with soft quills that harden with keratin over a few days. Us humans also have keratin in our hair. The young porcupine will stay with its mother for four to five months. Then it's on its own. Porcupines are solitary animals. This means they usually live alone. Let's take
take a look at the IUCN Red List. The list studies how the animals are doing and tells us which species are threatened. Most porcupine species are least concerned, meaning they are not endangered. Hooray! But there are a couple species like the Philippines porcupine and Brussels spined porcupine that are in vulnerable status. Porcupines are so cool, just like Ash. They are gentle animals, but they know how to bravely fight back with their mighty quills against bigger and more ferocious predators. I wish porcupines can live among us forever and ever. Yay! That's a wrap for Thor Thor Jungle Book on Porcupines. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and don't forget.